Today's verse comes once again from the Gospel of Luke from the 16th chapter, and it comes after Jesus tells one of his more interesting parables about a dishonest manager who is being fired because he hasn't done his job well and he actually does something dishonest in order to help ensure his own future. He goes to the creditors who all owe his boss money and encourages them to say that they owe less than they do and to give him a cut of it. And then Jesus commends the shrewdness of the dishonest manager and then he shares our verse of the day which is this, whoever is faithful in a very little is faithful also in much and whoever is dishonest in very little is dishonest also in much. What does that verse tell us? It tells us again about a person's character as so many of these passages from Luke's Gospel proclaim. It's all about who we are as a person. And people who are trustworthy in small things in life tend to be trustworthy in greater responsibilities. And people who are dishonest or who will cheat in small things are also very likely to do the same things when given greater opportunity. It's been said if you want to test a person's character, give them power. Because when people have power to act, who they are really comes out when there aren't restrictions on either what they're able to do or what they're allowed to do. How are you doing in being faithful in little or faithful in much. I went to PB Boulangerie uh, a while ago now and I got an order, I got different things. I uh, got a croque monsieur, which is something that Jill really likes, a ham and cheese sandwich, and got a loaf of bread and a pastry and something else. And I paid for my order and I walked out to the car and I put the bag on the passenger seat. And as I walked around the car and got in, in my head I was calculating how much I thought everything cost and I knew how much money I had paid and I thought about the change I received and it occurred to me that the young man behind the counter hadn't charged me for the sandwich which was the most expensive thing that I had bought. So I walked back into the store and there was a line of people and I waited until the young man finished helping the person who was at the front of the line. and. Then I looked at him and I said, excuse me, but I don't think you charge me for the sandwich. And the young man looked at me somewhat surprised and he said, thank you so much for being honest. And I looked at him and said without blinking, I value my honor and integrity a lot more than the cost of a sandwich. <laughs> being faithful in a little is how we learn and shape ourselves to be faithful in much. Don't underestimate the small things. They often lead to larger things. Be faithful. Be honest. Be truthful.